here. Oh, I see. So, blue button, this is all the pages. Yeah. And before you do anything, make sure that you wait for this uh, the screen. We'll shift over to, to this, this one right here. A little warm up and light up. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Okay. It does funky things if you just start it straight away. And okay. sometimes sensors won't read properly and you'll just get these weird readings like what's going on. Gotcha. Mm -hmm. So yeah, left side here if you want to see. Yeah. So there's gearbox and everything. I'm sure you'll have time to go through. Oh, I see. So there's pressures here, oil, yeah. fuel, parametric. Um, and then you got water, oil, air, and gearbox temp. Okay. Switch over, you can go through brakes, inputs, speeds, just everything you got need it. is pretty much in here. And at the same hand, after sessions, you can okay. pull the data from over there and it can do your thing, so I'm sure. Got it, yeah, yeah. And the cool suit is turned on by the switch directly below, where it says cool. Gotcha. If you leave it on without anything, it'll burn out the motor. It's not a big deal, not super expensive, but still a pain if you're yeah, out on the hot weekend. Yeah. So right hand is master. Uh-huh. So you'll switch that. Master. Uh-huh. And then you'll hear everything electrically goes on. If it's been sitting, All the, the compressor turns everything. on. everything. Exactly. Yeah. So that'll switch over. Uh-huh. That's ignition, so now the fuel pump's going and you can hear it. Okay. Um, one of the issues that we've had before on the other car uh -huh. is when you switch it, the fuel pump won't go. And that has to do with the switches on here, uh -huh. just so you're prepared. If you switch that, don't hear the fuel pump. First yeah. thing to check is there. It's behind the... It's just yeah. a wire? Um, wiring issue? Yeah, I think the other people just put it on to the just wall. So okay. That, okay. And then from there, make sure everything's good. If you haven't started it, because I started it before you guys got here to make sure the battery was good and everything. Yeah. What you're going to want to do is turn off ignition and uh -huh. just crank it a couple times and wait for the oil reading. For oil pressure. Exactly. Got just it. to make sure something's going good. Yeah. And then once you turn ignition on, you'll see the fuel build. Okay. And then that's where... There's no master outside the car, right? There is. There is, yeah. Okay. So that's that's right here. They actually don't Got it. Down. So fire and then master. Okay. General rule. Yeah. Don't, don't mess with that. Because no, someone makes a mistake and then you have a bad day at the track. And <laughs> no, the fire in case there is that, we know where totally. it's like, okay. The extinguisher is behind the seat. So if that okay. does happen, you're... It's you're going to get drenched. Yeah, <laughs> it's fine. Sick. Yeah. It's kind of hot. <laughs> Here we go, here we go. <laughs> he said they considered the canards as uh, consumables. I'm pretty sure everything oh, on the exterior is yeah. consumable. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. We uh, deleted these. We duct taped them. We like a Jeep and delete the doors. Never really had shit. One the <laughs> <laughs> you know, right. the clutch, dude. Why are they so close? Yeah, my, my shoes barely cleared it. Yeah. The, really why is the brake so small? 
No, the brake pedal's huge. You don't need the brake pedal's brakes. huge, the throttle's you small. Need the then uh, the clutch is small too. Oh, that's the, that's the brake. Yeah, that's the brake. You're not oh, used to I was that because you have pedal. a Supra oh, and it's automatic. <laughs> you forgot about the clutch pedal. There's three pedals. <laughs> <laughs>